Hello and welcome. This is Corey from the Bonner Scholar YouTube channel. I am really excited. I am really, really stoked. I have two new books that uh, I recently published and links are below this video. They're both available hard copy and PDF, printable PDF that is from the Bonner Scholar website. Two very, very important books that all pianists must have. These are groundbreaking books, groundbreaking. The first one is called A New and Improved System of Scale Fingering. I have a new system of scale fingering for all 24 major and minor scales, which is based uh, more on logic and uh, symmetry than our traditional system is. Our traditional system is, is filled with inconsistencies and contradictions. And I explain that in this book, why the traditional system is not fully optimized. So what I, basically what I've done is I've taken the traditional fingerings that we use for major and minor scales, and I have fully optimized them using mirror symmetry. And it's all explained here. It's very mathematical and very scientific. So uh, you might want to get this book and learn about this new system of fingering. It really is going to take the world by storm. Then I have another book, an offshoot of this book, which is called The 12 Major Scales with a new, with new and Improved Fingering. So basically what I do in this book is I, I don't go into the, the theory, the scale theory and everything, why this system is better. Instead, I take it from the approach of a teacher uh, teaching how to learn and how to teach these 12 major scales. And so I have a little preface here, and then I have the, uh, the actual scales laid out. It's beautiful, beautiful format here where I have uh, a, a, a unique system of learning the scales with these little charts with the whites and black keys, and then I have the actual sheet music on the bottom. So this is a, this is a shorter volume. It's great for beginners and also for teachers who want to know more about the system and would like to teach major scales using these fingerings. So I've got the major scale book here and I've got the full uh, fingering uh, system, fingering theory here in this book here. These are both required reading for all pianists. Now, let me explain to you why this was in the closet for over 30 years. I have a paper here which I dug out of a plastic bin. So let me, uh, let me just show you this little clip when I'm taking the bin out of the closet and I am unearthing this, this uh, paper that, that has dust and cobwebs on it from around 1992. All right, so here is Box Scholar's closet. So you get to see Box Scholar's uh, closet and all this stuff here. Let me see. Ah, copy of the Messiah uh, that I accompanied. Got a bunch of stuff here. A whole bunch of stuff just piled up here. Um, this stuff here. I don't even know what this is. Uh, let's see. Oh gosh. Get this. Okay, so we got this. I'm just going to put this down here like this. This down here like this. I put these down here. I don't. Really, I don't know. I don't really know what, what those are. I'm going to take this out here. This nice uh, plastic box here. This plastic bin. Let's see what's in this bin here. That's been in my closet for years like 30 something years all right so i dug out the uh the bin the plastic bin here with all the stuff in it i had to take all this stuff out here i know it's in here somewhere and i took out this pile here it's actually in this blue folder right here ah here we go so i have a few uh, sort of articles and papers that I did in the 1990s and uh, when I was in graduate school 
here we go. A new system of major scale fingering. It's a 15 page article on uh, basically my new system of fingering that, that I published uh, this week, actually, with Fox Scholar Publishing. This was before computers. I had to actually do this all on a typewriter or a word processor, and then I had to cut out musical examples. I had to actually write them out, cut them out, or photocopy some if, if they were music. It's so primitive. You can see, but it's a very well-written article, and this is a 15-page article on the new system of major scale fingering. Let's see what else I have here. Oh, I have an article I wrote in the 90s, it never published, uh, but I was working on it. I don't know if I submitted it anywhere, but John Bowles Walsingham, a neglected masterpiece. So I uh, did some research on that. So here's how I got to writing these two books. They actually uh, were finished in about two weeks. I, I worked full force on these to get these out as quickly as possible, and here's why. Originally, about a month ago, I was planning on writing a book called Fingering Hacks for Pianists, in which I explain fingering tricks and untraditional fingering techniques that pianists can use to their advantage to learn to play things easier. It's called Fingering Hacks for Pianists. Uh, this will be most likely my newer project coming up. But I came to the realization that as I was planning this book, Fingering Hacks for Pianists, I, I, I made reference to this new system of fingering here, which, well, hasn't ever been published before, before these new books. So I thought, well, Gosh, I, how am I going to make reference to this new system if they don't know about it? So, so I thought, well, first I have to publish the new system of fingering, and then later on down the line I can publish my fingering hacks book, which, you know, then, then you, you can have a sort of a point of reference for that. So, um, I, I wrote this paper in around 1992, and it was never published. The, the, I sent it to a major piano journal. It was rejected, most likely due to simply, uh, they don't want to hear anything new. Uh, if, if we've been using this system of fingering for over 200 years, why would they want to publish something telling people it's wrong and telling them that here's a new system of fingering? So I can understand why it was not published. I was very upset that it wasn't published. And so I thought, well, to hell with it. I'm just gonna just put this in the bin, put it in my closet and forget about it. So it's been in probably five, five or six closets in the course of 30 years, probably even more than that. All the houses and, and, and places I've lived in, in in the last 30 years. And so I uh, dug this out, revived it, and turned it in, I actually uh, expanded it to include the minor scales. This, this original paper was just major scales. And, and uh, I included the minor scales. And it's, it's a beautiful book. You need this beautiful book. Look at how beautiful that manuscript is here. You can learn all 24 major and minor scales with a new uh, system of fingering. This new system of fingering, I guarantee, you can learn these scales in record time because the traditional system of fingering that we all know and all the teachers know it and have taught it a million times, really when you analyze it, it's just filled with inconsistencies and contradictions. There really isn't any rhyme or reason to the traditional system outside of maybe eight fingerings. So out of 24 fingerings, uh, or out of 24 scales, the traditional system of fingering only has like eight good fingerings. And so all of the other 16 fingerings could be improved. And so I, I improved the traditional system with this new system. And it, it's, it's absolutely proven. It's not just my opinion. This is proven through a, a method of analysis I call symmetrical mirror analysis. That's kind of redundant, but we can just call it 
mirror analysis. And, and there's these pages here which explain that uh, this, this whole concept of mirror analysis and, and why one fingering on one side has to be equal to the fingering on the other side. It's very technical. So you need this book, you need to study it in depth, learn the new fingerings. I guarantee that these fingerings will be easier for you to learn the scales than the traditional fingerings. So I really want to help you out with learning those. I'll have more on this on YouTube. And of course, the 12 Major Scales Primer book, uh, great for teachers and also even advanced students and advanced pianists who would like to learn more about how the system applies to just the 12 major scales. We have 12 major scales, and we have all 24 major and minor scales here. And it's all from a paper that was in the closet for over 30 years. So I'm really, really excited about this. And uh, go to the links below this video where you can purchase uh, these two books, both in hard copy and PDF. Leave great comments below this video, and I'll see you in the next video.